I'm super excited to do experiment 17 in this kit here, 33 and 1 Deluxe Electronic Exploration Kit. It's on page 36. Here's the kit in here, and it's a flasher, a red and green flasher that alternate. This kit uses these parts in here, a nice transistor, a couple of transistors, capacitors that are um, have a polarity to them, as well as the LEDs that have a long and short lead to them. Those also have polarity, but the resistors don't. And polarity, when I say polarity, the electrons have to flow through the, uh, the part uh, specifically in that pattern. They cannot be flipped around and alternated. So here it is. I put the kit completely together following the instructions. I had to be a little bit careful on putting the parts in the correct row of the breadboard. Anything that's out of place there and the kit will not work. One thing I had to pay, uh, pay special attention to were the transistors using the correct ones. The course guide here mentions to use the 2N3904. This, uh, this lab in here has the 3904, the NPN, and the 3906. They look identical. And if you use the, the different one or the wrong one, this kit will not work. So pay close attention to that. Another thing on this kit that I had to pay attention to is the polarity of the LEDs. The course guide here indicates that there's a flat side to the LED and there is. It's very, very tiny, very minute. But there's another way to tell with a LED. Um, the flat side is also the negative side. And the negative side is usually the shorter LED lead of uh, leg of the LED. <laughs> Easy to say, huh? So in this case in here, here's the positive source coming in. So the longer side goes on the positive and the negative goes on the shorter side well let's plug it in see if that works another good thing to have on hand is to make sure that your battery is not drained you have a good charge in the battery which I'll do right now let's do a test okay 8.9 there you go Good voltage. Here it is. The moment we've been waiting for. Okay. Nice. This kit is assembled correctly. I'll just go back through that LEDs. Here's some things that um, I was trying to figure out if, if I did put this in or if I take it out. I'm missing a part now that just stays constant. I'll put this in backwards. Still doesn't work. I'll put it in the correct way. And it works. I'll do the same on this one. Just reference. Okay, that's on that side there. Oh wow, doesn't even go on. Put it in the opposite way. Still doesn't work. Wow. So if this one's incorrect, it shuts them both down. If this one's incorrect, it just shuts down that one. These are just some tips in here on how I got this to work. This is a fun kit. This is uh, experiment number 17, but there's uh, 33. So I'm going to keep going and try uh, some more experiments. One last thing. This is also a nice handy tool to see what the these transistors to get the transistor I'd use this magnifying glass and it uh, it did show me that it was a 3904 it's printed right there so having a magnifying glass is a handy look only that side went on let's fix that there it is. All right. Just another little tip.
All right.